Hello beautiful friends, my name is Brittany. Welcome back or welcome to Rescues and Reads. This is just going to be a super short, quick video because I am on here asking for your help a viewer call to action, if you will. If you recently watched my February TBR, you will know that I was considering removing one of the prompts from my TBR game. It is the emoji prompt where I basically use a random emoji generator to give me a random emoji. And then I try to use that emoji to select a book to read. And it wasn't really working out like I thought it would. There were just so many like random and obscure emojis, a lot of which I didn't even know what they were, let alone being able to actually select a book for them. And so because of that, I was considering removing it. Well, I have officially made the decision to remove it from the board. But of course, that means I now have to replace it with something. And when I was thinking about what I wanted to replace it with, I thought about the fact that I didn't actually have viewer involvement with my TBR game overall. I have prompts on the board where, you know, my husband picks a book for me to read or where even a friend picks a book for me to read, but I don't actually have a prompt where my viewers pick a book for me to read. And so that is where I'm asking for your help. I want you to give me recommendations from my TBR pile on what you think I should absolutely read, like what you think I should prioritize. So during December, during book mess, I did a video where I showcased all of my physically owned unread TBR books. Now, some of that has slightly changed just because since that time I have read a handful of those books, but for the most part, it remains largely unchanged. So that is a great video to watch if you want to see what I physically own that I have not read, but also on my Goodreads want to read shelf, all of my physically owned unread TBR books are on there along with basically any other book that I want to read, but don't own. So that one to read shelf is really where literally every single book on my TBR lives. I will be sure to have that book miss video as well as my Goodreads want to read shelf linked down below. And so what I'm asking you to do is to visit one of those places based on what you see that I currently want to read. Provide me with recommendations of books that you want to see me read, books that you think I absolutely need to get to. And then on this video, leave those recommendations down in the comments below. I don't care how many books you want to recommend to me. You can recommend dozens if you want. I just ask that each recommendation is its own separate comment. That will make it easier for me because when I do land on this prompt on my TBR game, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to a random comment generator for this video and it's going to pop up a random comment. And so if there's only one book listed, that will make it really clear cut as to what I need to read. Now, of course, if I've already read the book or DNF the book or on haul the book, whatnot, I will go ahead and move on to another comment. But basically the gist is that by using your recommendations and your comments, I will be able to select some books for my TBR should I land on the viewer recommendation prompt. So that's it. That is my call to action. If you could please visit my Goodreads want to read shelf, or if you could please watch that video showing all of my physically owned unread TBR books and leave your recommendations down below, I would be eternally grateful and you will officially be an interactive part of my TBR game. That makes it even more special to me being able to play the game and knowing that y'all have some part in what I read. But aside from that, y'all, that is it. Like I said, super quick, super fast. I just wanted to come on here asking for your help. And I look forward to seeing all the comments down below with your top recommendations. As always, if you like this video or if you just like me, please be sure to give it a big thumbs up. I post two videos a week, sometimes three, if I have my shit together and I actually have a video to film and I would sure love to see you in one of those next videos. Bye guys.